from Luke's Gospel. There was also an inscription over Jesus. This is the king of the Jews. One of the criminals who were hanged railed at him, saying, Are you not the Christ? Save yourself and us. But the other rebuked him, saying, Do you not fear God? since you are under the same sentence of condemnation, and we indeed justly, for we are receiving the due reward of our deeds. But this man has done nothing wrong. And he said, Jesus, remember me when you come into your kingdom. And Jesus said to him, Truly, I say to you, today you will be with me in paradise. May I speak in the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. One of the last things Jesus said were the words he spoke to someone whom he did not know until the man was dying. Today, Thou shalt be with me in paradise. If you stop to think of where Jesus says these words and to whom he says them, it's no wonder that Sanhedrin piety and Roman politics wanted to kill him. Reduced to dying on a cross, he speaks as if he were a king presuming that paradise of all places is where he's going and promising a thief of all people that he'll take him there. There was just the dying left to do. Paradise. We left it. Left it so far behind and so long ago that we've squandered all but our vaguest memory of it. If Jesus has, in his death, the power to save us, it's not surprising that these would be among his last words. In the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.